Welcome back to Raw Sports Talk. I'm Chris, your favorite stat reader, and we have the Bruins hosting the Stars. The Stars are minus 120 on the money line. The Bruins are plus 100. The over-under is five and a half goals. The Stars laying a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 220, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two goals or more. And the Bruins getting a goal and a half on the puck line are minus 270, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you'd win. They lose by one goal, you win. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to puck drop tomorrow. It's supposed to be Ottinger in net for the Stars and Swayman in net for the Bruins. Head to head, the Bruins are 8 and 2. The Bruins are on a four game winning streak. The home team is 7 and 3. The favorite is 8 and 2 on the money line, while the underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is 8 and 2. There have been seven one goal games in their last 10, including the last three that they've played against each other. The under is 7 and 3, and the under 5.5 goals is also 7 and 3. They played each other twice last year. The Bruins won both games. 3 to 2 in Dallas and then 4 to 3 in shootout in a shootout in Boston. The Stars are 2 and 2 in their last four, five goals, five goals, five goals, six goals, three goals and a win, two goals and a loss, four goals and a win and then two goals and a loss. The Bruins I, I don't know what the hell's going on with the Bruins. 1 2 and 1 in their last four games. Seven goals, eight goals, three goals, four goals, three goals and a loss, five goals and a win, one goal and an overtime loss and then shut out by the winless Predators, well, now they're not winless anymore. I imagine that this is just the Bruins taking some time to get used to the new bodies that are there because they had to sign Swayman to that contract, so they had to let people go. But this is just a level of disappointment. And, like, the Bruins used to be automatic at home, like, especially getting them as an underdog. But, I, I like, I don't know. They're not, they're not scoring. They don't look good right now. I'm going to take the Stars with the money line. I'll take the stars laying the goals, and I'm going to go under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.